Alright. So the waiting game commences once again. At least we think so. This should be the last one, right? I think so. It's all three, so I can't imagine it not being. I feel like we need to go to that one room. What one room? Nah. If only there was a way to, like, go in the basement. There will be. <laughs> Fuck lights. <laughs> <laughs> That's just him right there. That's not a lamp. It's a clown! <laughs> it's a lamp-shaped clown. I have my drink. Where's your drink? I like your strategy, Sorry. Nathan. What, the circle? We're gonna do spin circles. Spin circles? <clears throat> you spin me right around. I mean, that keeps you safe from Chester. Yeah, it does. Uh. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm done trying to scare you. So the proper strategy here is to do circles. Um, Kiki and Mr. Taters, TC, you have a small time. Esquire. TC Esquire, the third, you have a small time frame with them. So like you can get out of the room, stand still, and find Kiki. <laughs> Whoop, look over here. I'm not scared of this game. <laughs> I don't oh, know I why. Th I thought the light just didn't turn on. <laughs> I'm usually a huge pansy. This game, though, it's not doing it for me. It's, it's fun, but I'm not. I'm not scared. Yeah, it's scared. I'm not scared. <laughs> then it goes to five. Or 1220 and everything just gets super serious. Like, the ground just opens up, hellfire, <laughs> demons. I was thinking that. <laughs> Knightson's worst fear. Get out of the uh. room. Wrong room. <laughs> Shit, find the bitch. It's getting complicated. It's getting complicated. Like that one A Day to Remember song. Which one? The one that has like a really complex title. There's a lot of those. Like, the one that's, like, you know, they got all kinds of crazy titles, but this one's, like, really convoluted and complex. What'd you call it? Um, I don't know, Knights, and what is it? It's complicated. Oh, you're a piece of shit. I know. Let me live it down. <laughs> live what down? That? It's not living down. I'm not throwing it in your face. I thought it was just a great story. I hate that story. I love that story. Is that an actual story that happened? Yeah. I had just I just learned the song uh It's Complicated by Data Remember. And I was like, Hey Nathan, what's that a uh, a Data Remember song? He's like, which one? And I'm like, Oh, you know the one that's like uh really weird and complex? He's like, which one? And I'm like, I don't know, it's really like got a weird name or whatever. And then <laughs> he he was like trying to have a conversation with me, like about what it was for like forty five seconds, and then I've nowhere he's just like Fuck you! Fuck you! He's piece of shit! Like, just started doing the generic insults all of a sudden. He's basically just sitting there like, <clears throat> I'm like, Knightson, which one? He's like, I don't know, it's complicated. I'm like, all of them are complicated. He's like, it's just, it's a comp, it's complicated. It's a complicated title. Which one? They're all complicated. <laughs> There's just like sitting there like, silence, silence, silence. Which one, Knightson? No! No! I forgot how to run. He was like, which one, Knightson? Uh, I don't know. Like 20 seconds of a silence as I'm sitting there trying to think. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. At we Warp Tour. We were driving back at that point. Were we driving back? Yeah. I thought we were driving too. No, we were driving back. Okay. Warp Tour is always fun. Yeah, it is. Last year's was kind of lame. I liked last year's. Um, but like, it was really chill. Um, but you know why I liked it, of course. Yeah, it had the Wonder Years and Aaron West. 
That was so good, dude. See, I'm excited for this year's Warp Tour. You know, we got real big fish going. We got yeah. some 41. <laughs> Less than Jake. Less than Jake. Super thrilled. I'm excited. Not yet. We probably just woke him up from being too loud and scared. My thing is, uh... Yeah, I'm actually dead. Um, my thing is, I, I hope that I'm in better shape this year. So I don't die of heat stroke again. So I can actually see all the bands I want to see this year. Alright, I can wait. You gotta find her. I found her. I found both of them. Yeah, dude, the first time I saw the Wonder Years at Warp Tour, they were such a small crowd. I just remember fucking up really bad at Warp Tour. How? Uh, it was I set my friends on fire, and I was like, okay, I just I just figured out about this band. Let's let's give them a listen. There was one song that I thought I absolutely knew, and I think oh, that was yeah. yeah. I thought it was like uh, I think it was ravenous ravenous rhinos or what rhymes with the orange. One of them too. You know, it's got the breakdown, and then at the beginning, it's like, what the fuck? And everyone stood up at the same time, like said what the fuck and I stood up with them and I said how the fuck and they all just <laughs> stared at me like that clown and all just, everyone in the vicinity the everyone in the vicinity just turned and looked at me like why are you over here shouting the wrong fucking words and I'm like I'm just gonna go find Nights and that's about the point that I got up and left to go look for you it's like you're just like everyone says I was like what the fuck and you're like when <laughs> How now, brown cow? <laughs> How now, brown cow? <laughs> How now, brown cow? <laughs> um, yeah, no. The the first time I saw one of you, though, I can't I can't imagine there being more than like fifty people. I remember you like hugged Soupy, and he was totally cool with it. I didn't hug Soupy. I thought you hugged him. You got him no. next to him. Oh yeah, I was really close to him. I I touched him. I touched Soupy. I'm never washing my arm again. Yeah, when they did a uh, Washington Square Park, he jumped down and uh, like kind of crowd made friends. He like just kind of crowd surf like right near everyone, so he was like singing with the microphone, but like touching everyone. I was all up in that, but all up in that soupy, all up in that soupy. But like th this last year, they, they had a crazy amount of people there. I mean, it was probably well over what 100, maybe pushing 152. <laughs> uh, let's see, warp tour stories. Um, Oh, yeah, but uh, I'm a larger man, and I... Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Oh! Get out of the other room! Jesus Christ! <laughs> he came out of nowhere! I feel so bad for your dad. <laughs> yeah, you kind of, like, looked at him, looked at an open door, and then just ran for the closed door. <laughs> I love that. He's just ah, running at you. You're like, oh no. I, I've never seen him like run before. <laughs> they just came out of nowhere. That was so goofy looking too. It's just... <laughs> He's like Sonic the Hedgehog up in this shit. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> um, I keep thinking the right trigger is the run button. No, click in on the end. Yeah, I know. Um, no. No. Zoom. Whoa. Yeah, you can zoom. Yeah, so uh, after, like, I basically just spent the whole day, like, walking around, like, checking out other bands. But then once uh, the one of you were playing, I was just, like, <laughs> like, just crazy up in the that? front. What? One of them made a noise. <laughs> that one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I was up front and I, I was just, you know, going to town. And then, considering it was, like, right after rain, I think, and in the middle of, like, late July. In the middle of late July. It was late July. <laughs> in the middle of late July. <laughs> and everything was like 100 degrees out. So after I got done, I'm like, huh, I feel like death. I feel like I'm literally going to die. So I just kind of sat down, um, found some water, got in it, and then like, was still like, I am, I am passing out. I'm literally passing out right now. That's fun at Warped Tour 2011. Oh, it was... 2011? Yeah, that was really good. That was probably my favorite. That's where I met the most bands. I mean, I think 20... <laughs> third... Fourth... When did we go last? 15? 20... 
was the 11 last year? and 2015. Yeah. <laughs> what? We were probably staring right at him, but the light fell off. No, I saw him. I turned around. Whatever. I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this. Um, let's see. 2011, I went to the condom tent. They gave me a free condom. Dude, that condom roller coaster was the bomb. That roller coaster, though, man. That roller coaster was pretty cool. I took that condom. I found a line of people. And I was like, I don't know what this line is. So I skipped to the front. And, uh, Davi Vanity, the guy from Blood on the Dance Floor. Dude, gross, right? Was. I, I, I like some songs from Blood on the Dance Floor. Yeah, there was a couple. But he was up there. And I got to hang out with him. And then the fucking the security guard lady came up. She's like, "Hey, you can't cut the line." And Dobby was like, "Nah, dog, he's cool. Look, he's got lips as big as mine." And I was like, "Cool, yeah." <laughs> and he's like, "Anything I can sign for you?" And I was like, "This condom." He's like, Are "You gonna use it?" I'm like, "No." He's like, "Awesome. High five. Abstinence." So that was a, <laughs> that was a fun story. Did he really high five you for abstinence? Yeah. Oh Jesus. Uh. <laughs> Shit! Get out of the room. Oh. You're dead. Keep your eyes on her. Fucking A. <laughs> this is expert, just so you know. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, um, I don't know. I, I mean, I met Soupy, of course, um, at 2011. They, they unfortunately made you, like, get tickets ahead of time for 2015, which I didn't know they didn't announce, but I met a couple people. It was really cool. Yeah, we met the guy from that one band that we saw in 2011. <laughs> oh, yeah. The, uh, the Triangle. In Passing. In Passing. Yeah, because we met in Passing. And, yeah. then the, and, and, and then the Rainbow Beard. Oh, yeah. His <laughs> sticker. I still have a sticker. I put it on the binder. He didn't say anything. No. He just came by and gave you a sticker. <laughs> yeah, there was just some guy who uh, had a rainbow beard. And uh, I yelled at him. I complimented him. I'm like, hey, nice beard. And then he 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 found knights and he points at me, gives me a thumbs up, and then says, "Hold like holds up with one finger, reaches in his back pocket, pulls out a sticker with his own face on it, and is like, my God." And that sticker is now on Knightson's binder. Yes. Oh, this is just so. Uh, did I tell you that I met. Uh, yeah, I told you that I met Ask Alexandria. Uh, you probably did. I don't remember it. Fucking, we get to warp to her. I walk in. I'm almost out of cigarettes. I'm like, shit, today's gonna be awful. Full pack of cigarettes on the ground. Today's gonna be great. I pick them up. Start walking around. I'm like, you know, that guy over there looks familiar. And I see this dude. I'm like, I think that's Ben Bruce from Asking Alexandria. I was really big into them at the time. So I follow him. And he goes behind one of the sets. Safe place. <laughs> on the ceiling. <laughs> He just creeps out like train spotting. <laughs> no! But yeah. So, oh, uh -huh. So I find him, I follow him, I go behind one of the sets, and they're all back there. Danny's sitting there drinking on some Jack Daniels, and I'm like, whoa, this is cool. And they're like, oh, hey, what's going on, mate? And I walk over, Wait, and I start hanging What? Out. Where are they from? Uh, They're from England? Warshire, I think. Really? Cheshire. Like the cat? Meow. Meow. Go away, cat. Go away. <laughs> like... I like how we said check our cat and she pokes her head out from behind the TV <laughs> with those creepy demon eyes. Put those back. I know, like, you can't really see her. You can just see her eyes. It's terrifying. They look like marbles. But no. Stop yeah. it! No! This is... Oh, shit. Not cool, cat. Get out of here. Get out of the way, you stupid. Take this. Hold it. I'm sorry. Anyway, so I see him follow them back there and they're like oh what's going on mate you know they're sitting there drinking on some jack they're like you want a drink i'm like nah man i've got some cigarettes on me it's the rest of my exeters they're like what are you smoking on i'm like it's exeters and they're like oh gross that's nasty i was like yeah they're not the best and then like this dude walks back and he's like oh my god you guys are asking alexandria and this is when i realized that they're kind of assholes find her because like danny was just like oh i bug off mate to this random guy. Why did you move? It looked, I tapped it and it moved. Ugh. Yeah, I met them. And then you remember the Buddhist monks in the beginning? They yeah. were handing out the books. Douchebag Buddhist monks. It was like, oh, do you want a free book? Yeah. 
Five dollars. Minimum purchase. <laughs> five dollars donation. I don't have five dollars. We're taking our book back. <laughs> you know what? More stories. One second. More. <clears throat> More stories next time. Goodbye.